My name is Jason Gerlich and I'm from Houston, Texas. My academic background is in watershed science and soil and crop sciences. I got my degree from Colorado State University and my interest has always lied to the nexus of hydrology and agronomy focused on water quality. I was part of the first MSOGLO cohort from September 2019 through September 2021. My specialization was in physical land resources. This program is specific, yet broad enough to make it what you want it to be. There are many different topics that fall under the umbrella of soil science and global change, from carbon cycling to mapping projects to crop yield modeling all the way to water quality. If you have an interest in the environmental field, this degree will complement your previous studies greatly. I know it did mine, and I know it's more than worth your time. My thesis topic was on the use of soil amendments, specifically gypsum, and improving soil physical properties to reduce nutrient runoff from arable fields in northern Denmark. I'm currently a research specialist at the Texas Water Resources Institute. In my career, I spent ample time in the field studying surface water quality in rivers, creeks, and streams across the state of Texas. The field work complements additional mapping and open source data acquisition in order to compile information on watersheds with impaired waterways. The skills I learned in MSOGLO, like technical writing, stats, coding, mapping, and field skills get applied daily in my career. Classes like Applied Statistics land information, soil physics, pedology, nutrient cycling, climate change, and more, all developed an educational foundation of knowledge that benefits my career, those that I work for, and the stakeholders that I work with. Some important do's in this program are get to know all of your classmates and professors, do your homework, and most importantly, enjoy yourself. Immerse yourself in the cultural education that this program provides as well. Now finally, speaking from experience, always wear a helmet when biking. Some important don'ts, do not wait to get your visa paperwork in. And always have lots of patience with the embassies and be on time with all your application processes.